What's Goody Barons? On this week's episode, we explore some meal options. Match teachers with their picks. See some talented students in our community. And check in with our Baron athletes. I'm Noah Light. And I'm Sanaya Mero. And, and you're, you're watching, watching BCC TV. What's going on in the news this week, Sanaya? International Night is almost upon us. It will be on February 12th. They're looking for all kinds of talent to be shown, and everyone is encouraged to get involved, whether that be performing or bringing a dish. Students can get up to 15 SSL hours for participating. In other news, Westwood Tower and Bethesda caught fire due to electrical issues on Saturday. Thankfully, there were no casualties. What a relief. Let's check in with some people who are going to need some relief after this food trip. What's up, Barons? And welcome to Pimp My Meal. This week, we're at Subway, and Jake and Keon are going to be competing to make the most disgusting sandwich for the other to eat. Let's get into it. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. That all looks so incredibly interesting. Y'all warriors for real. Let's be honest, it does not look good. That's what I was getting at, short sack. Anyways, speaking of short sack, there are a few teachers here who are pretty young. I kind of want to see their baby pictures. Let's see if we can match the youngster to the teacher.
sure did surprise me. I did not expect them to look like that. You know what else I didn't expect? A few sophomores having their own record company. Hey guys, it's Breakfast All Day Records. I'm Sophia Geyer. I'm Tony Totirino. And our third partner couldn't make it today, but that's Toby Zapruder. What are the origins of your name? Where did it come from? So, right after school let out last year, there was a show at Art Sound Language, which is a record store. Tanito was playing drums, I was working the event, and we took a break, and like we went and we sat on this bench, like a couple blocks down, like right outside the American Diner. And we were just like sitting and talking about how like it's so crazy, like we've known each other our whole lives, but we didn't really get close until like we bonded over music, and then we were like talking about how important like the community around music is. And we were saying like how we've always wanted to do something like start a record label. And we were like, well, what if we just did? So we were on that bench and we were throwing out names. One that really came to mind was we looked right in front of us at that diner. We saw breakfast all day. And I was like, oh, Sophia, breakfast all day. And she was like, yeah, that's a good one. That's it. Like, that's uh, it. That's chill, yeah. Tell us, how is it running a business as two high schoolers? At first, we were definitely like a little bit in over our heads. Like we were filing legal documents, opening a bank account getting an LLC and that was all like obviously like, a lot like I'm really 15 like I feel like I've gotten a lot better like equipped at, like actually running a business. It's also really difficult juggling that in academics but when it's something you're passionate about you try and make time for it. What do you look for in a band? Is anyone already signed under your label? Um, we're pretty open in like in terms of genre. Yeah we've signed Bethesda band Scoria. We've, we've got a couple other ones that we're looking at, but we've also been working with Michigan-based indie rock band Kingfisher. That's our first final project, which you can order on our website. Who or what inspires you? Definitely other record labels that I've just like seen start out on their journey. Yeah, for sure. One, Discord Records is a big one. They're based in DC, Ian Mackay. What do you want to tell BCC about records all day? Especially for me, I think community and getting involved is such an important thing. and. Having bands play at venues, it really creates a good community and helps people get to know each other. Yeah, it's definitely like a really good way to like meet people, make new friends, and even like like if you just go to any local show like in DC, you have like a 50% chance of meeting like Ian Mackay, who's like a very famous like punk artist from 2000. So that's like really cool. That's it. Thank you for being here. Back, Back to, to you, you Noah and Sanaya. Starting a record company that young is amazing. It really is. Good luck to them. It doesn't look like they need much. Just like our Baron athletes. Let's pass it down to our sports anchor to see what's been going on. What's up, Barons? I'm Dean, and I'm your sports anchor this week. Boys basketball is coming off a great dub against division rivals Churchill, and look forward to the biggest game of the season, Whitman at home tonight at 5.30. Girls basketball is back and dominating climbing to the Washington Post number 11 spot in the rankings. They beat Churchill and Einstein and will play women at 7.15 tonight. This will be another action-packed night, so make sure to get your tickets on GoFan as soon as possible. In swim and dive news, the girls won big and the boys lost a close one. They'll face Whitman this weekend. Good luck. Our wrestlers are coming off a big win against Churchill last week. They faced Magruder on Wednesday and they won. And a huge congratulations to Palms for coming in third place at the Springbrook Invitational and placing in their first competition in Division I. Palms will be performing at the Wizards game on Wednesday, January 24th, so make sure to get your tickets with this QR code. That's it for this week. I'll see you at basketball tonight. Back to you, Noah and Sanaya. And that's all for this week, Barons. Take back next episode for more news, updates, and humor. Keep the standards high. And stay classy, BCC. I'm Noah Light. And I'm Sanaya Merrill. And, and we're, we're signing, signing off. off. Should I do Mickey Mouse now? No. Oh, oh wait. <laughs> oh, oh, oh boy. I'm Mickey Mouse and we're signing off. <laughs> Was that good? Was that good? Was that good?